the kids in school hear Aiden's story, they taunt him, but Aiden still clings to his story. As he becomes more of an outcast, Lucas becomes more and more concerned. Being on Aiden's side would mean believing the impossible. But how can you believe the impossible when everything and everybody is telling you not to? The Line of Mars is the story of 11-year-old Bell, the youngest kid in the American settlement on Mars in 2091. Bell has spent his whole life on Mars, but he's still just a regular kid. He loves cats, any kind of cake, worries about friendships, and he asks a lot of questions. There aren't many rules he has to follow on Mars, but there are a few in place that are strictly enforced. One of these is, is about not interacting with the other country's settlements, even though it seems as though they were in international friendships in the past. When a virus breaks out and the grown-ups fall ill, Belle and all the other children are the only ones who can help. Their only hope is to somehow make it to the nearest settlement and ask for help. But if Belle can even make it to the settlement, would they help him or would they turn him away? It's up to Belle, a regular kid in a very different world, to uncover the truth and save his family and possibly unite the entire planet. Check out The Line of Mars by Jennifer Holmes from Harford County Public Library. Call your favorite branch or go to hcplonline.org.